Welcome to Austria, Agent 47. Your targets are Dorian Lang, Guillaume Maison, and Doris Lee, three remaining members of the international gang of thieves known as the Yardbirds. The Yardbirds were famous for the daring heists, in particular, one that took place against Shamal Casino in Las Vegas. However, the money proved to be the property of organized criminals who in turn launched a campaign of violence and retaliation in an effort to identify the thieves and find the money. Feeling the earth burn beneath them, the Yardbirds entered into a secret agreement. The treasure would remain hidden, and once the dust settled, the last remaining member was to inherit everything. The group retired, and all members vanished from sight until Calvin Ritter, the Sparrow, was found dead on his yacht. But the remaining members remained elusive. The group never gathers in one place, but today is a special occasion. The wedding of Elizabeth Lang is taking place at the palatial home of Guillaume Maison with Doris Lee as a special guest. Our client is Alexander Kovac, the founder of the Yardbirds. He has stipulated that all three targets and their bodyguards must be eliminated at this event. Should any of the Yardbirds escape, the contract is invalidated. Looks like Kovac is making his final bid for the Los Millions. What is up, you fucking hooligans? It is the crazy bastard himself, the one you are wasting a part of your life watching, and I appreciate that, by the way. Today's video, we are playing Hitman Sniper Assassin, a new game mode that you unlock if you pre-order Hitman 2. So guilty as charged, this fucker downloaded or pre-ordered Hitman 2. Will I regret it later on when I have a financial crisis? Probably. Will I regret it now? I don't know, probably not, because I'm excited for Hitman 2, and I'm excited that I get to play this game mode as I wait. Now, the whole point of this is we return to our assassin, a regular old assassin, with a sniper rifle this time. We sit at a vantage point and we snipe fuckers from a vantage point that, to an area we cannot even venture around. We're, we're confined to a small, tiny location. So there's that. Now, we, I would normally find somebody to play with on this co-op mission, but I, I just can't do it. There's nobody else that I know that got this game too, so, you know, I don't want to jump on here and play with a random stranger, stranger danger, okay? I, I, I don't want to be taken into a minivan or whatever, so we're going to be playing as Agent 47. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. I'm done talking your ears off. Like and subscribe, comment your thoughts below, and let's get back to our assassin. So this is our first time, meaning we will not be serious or serial. Wait, serial? Moving on. We are not cracking this mission down to the core essentials that are the complicated challenges that I and some other people like to do on our spare time. Instead, you will be seeing me playing this for the first time, so I will be fucking around, I will be messing up, but along the way, we'll have fun. And that's important. So our targets are simple. Dorian Lane and this... Fuck, how do you pronounce his name again? Guillaume! Guillaume is on. I'm gonna call him Guil. Moving on. We also got Doris Lee and these bodyguards to take care of. So, we have the bodyguards and these three bitches to take care of. Good. So, unfortunately, we cannot change the skins on this game. Damn it! But we do have a biography, so I'll try to read this like a fucking pro. <clears throat> AG-47 is the world's top assassin, a legendary figure in the shadowy trade of assassination. It's expert strategist, master of disguises, and social chameleon who is always two of the head. He's a skilled predator, discreet, precise, and endlessly inventive. A man comfortable in his own skin and in total control of his environment, 47 deals exclusively in disappearances, tragic accidents, and natural causes with no collateral damage. He is a ghost rarely noticed and never remembered. Okay then. That's some shit you could put on a dating website like Zisk. Ooh. Good afternoon, 47. The wedding ceremony is about to begin with Lang and his daughter arriving shortly Aww. by car. How it cute. is expected that they will proceed directly to the open area where the groom and priest is waiting, along with all the wedding guests. Guillaume Maison has been on site all day, preparing the wedding details and entertaining guests. I expect he will also attend the ceremony. Doris Lee is en route via helicopter and should be arriving any minute now. My intel suggests she will not be watching the bride and groom exchange vows, but do keep a lookout anyway. We are working within a limited window of opportunity here, 47. 
We expect the targets to stay for no longer than 15 minutes. Good luck, 47. All right. Let's look around, okay? It looks like we're in like an old little castle looking thing, a little house made out of brick. Let's see. We're here to fuck around. I'm not here to try to be efficient about this. So let's see. The goal was to go and take out bodyguards, right? So first off, I hit him in the shoulder. That hurts. Oh, he saw me. What? I shot him in the... There we go. There we go. Moving on. He saw it too. What the fuck is... Apparently, binoculars are bulletproof. Oh, there she is. That is Doris Lee, a.k.a. the Goldfinch. Former Hollywood stunt woman of okay. Cheyenne descent. The situation is about to become critical. Lee has been eliminated. There we go. Situ the situation contained. I was a little quiet there. I wanted to be focused. That's not a... That's the guard I want. Forty-seven. Someone's on to you. What? You cannot see this! It's not for the eyes. God, I'm killing civilians too. Oh, he's on the other side of the wall. You're about to be spotted. Where the fucking... Get the fuck out of here! What the... Sh I shot him in the fucking hand. They're about to raise the alarm. Shut... Silence! Oh my god. Okay. That guard's gonna fucking find the body. So let's... I'm surprised that nobody saw that. There we go. And nobody suspected the thing. And we just wait for this little bastard to just... That is Guillaume Maison, the Kingfisher. Former Interpol agent and the owner of the mansion and its grounds. What the... Cortisone, they're beginning to suspect something. That's Maison taken care of. Nice work, Cortisone. Damn it, he's behind that wall! 47, code red. Everyone is evacuating. No! <laughs> you cannot leave! Okay. We need to take out the rest of these guards. Jump! Oh, right in the ass! Okay. Alright. We're gonna redo this, and it's gonna be serious this time. There we go. Oh, he's leaving. He's leaving too. <laughs> oh my god, this is actually kind of entertaining. <laughs> Hold still. I suck at this. <laughs> Don't go. <laughs> Jesus. Why can't I shoot him? <laughs> no, don't leave. This is not the time to leave. Wait. Damn it. One got away. Damn it. He got into the helicopter. I nice suck at fucking aiming! Ah! I got a little score. It's okay though. This is actually kind of cool. This is my first time playing this. I don't care. But we're gonna redo this. We're gonna be serial this time. And we won't shoot any other. Any, 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 I'm having English issues right now. What? Am I forgetting my English? Am I going to have to get deported or something? Anyway, we're going to redo this, and I'm not going to shoot anybody in the butt tarts this time. I won't let them go through the ordeal Forrest Gump had to go through. Ready? Let's do this. Please there we go. Trying to yep. evacuate. You need to stop her from leaving, 47. Lang is down. Nice work, 47. God damn it. Son of a bitch. What's it going to take to shoot this bastard?
fucking hell. I'm surprised- I'm surprised I didn't hit anyone! Except for that target. Alright, this is our 42nd attempt at getting Silent Assassin. I, no joke, I had to restart this game 40 second times just to get the Silent Assassin. And he's dead. And he got a headshot. Nice shot. Oh, <laughs> headshot. Imp or shockwave bullets, so he has stuff flying over the ledge. This bullet to make him go into the bush. All these bitches out here. I'm being cereal right now. The These bitches don't even know what cereal is. Hell, they don't even know what the word serious is. How the hell are they supposed to know what cereal is if they don't know how to be serious? God. Now let's get him. Oh, shit. There we go. Very close. Alright. They will not discover the body there. I'm trying to be as quick as possible, but if not, then we'll take our time. But so far, so good. I'm quick, efficient, precise. I said we weren't supposed to do that, but I'm doing it. Shoot the bush right there to our first target to go over to that bush, or our real target. I don't want that chef dude to see what's going on, because I'm gonna shoot this bitch that in the bush. Is Doris. The there we go. Okay, so our second target is walking with his daughter, the bride. So, we'll take this opportunity to take some people. Oh my god, I didn't think I was gonna hit him. I thought I missed. Let's get that dude to go to the spot we want him. I'm gonna try something pretty sneaky, pretty dirty. Right here. Yeah, right there. I'm gonna see if I can try to shoot him through a crack or something and get him to fly over the ledge. Damn it. I can't get him through that. I mean, I have bullets that can go through the the concrete or the the foundation, but I don't want to waste them at least yet. So we're gonna lure him. We're gonna use my bullets since I have unlimited. We'll lure him to the spot I want him to go. All right, come on. You will come to this spot. Come this way, child. I will take you to paradise. It requires that you get a ticket to Bullet uh, Express. Oh, shit. It's okay, though. It's okay, though. If nobody sees the body, that's good. I was hoping to make him fly over the ledge with the shockwave bullets. But it's fine. We're good. I don't care. I'm not restarting this again. Ah, shit. Come on, go back in there. Go. Walk backwards. Yes! Ha! <laughs> Little bitch. Okay. This dude's on our budget list. I'm gonna go ahead and try to get him through this window. I'll wait until I see it. There he is. Alright. Oh, man. This is a beautiful day. What's that noise? I, I thought I was going to hit him, but it didn't work. Maybe I should go and investigate. Oh, another sh another stop. Oh, it's... Uh. <laughs> well I'm going to start doing that as a trend now. I'm going to start doing that as a habit, just like doing a voice for these guys that I shoot. Like this guy right here. We're going to try to get him to follow my bullets. Well, what sound is that coming from? Oh god. I keep seeing these bullet impacts, but they're definitely not from a bullet. Oh, another one. What is that? What is going on? Hmm, something is suspicious, I tell you. <laughs> uh. Out of sight, out of mind. Oh, what? what? What's going on? Whee! Alright. We have two targets and one more bodyguard to dispose of. So let's go ahead and uh, distract this guard real quick. Congratulations, old man. You are the first old per elderly person to go flying. They fly like a beautiful majestic eagle. All right, 
one more bodyguard and Was one more target to take out, and then we're out of here. We we fly into the sunset. So let's let this bodyguard go to where he was supposed to go to, and we'll shoot him then. And let's lead him over to that spot. I think that would be a better spot to go and shoot him. I don't see anything, sir. It must have been a must have been a bird. Whee! All right. Nice shot. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this old guy talk to his daughter and his now son-in-law. That's so nice. They got married. It just sucks though that we're murdering her father on her, on the day of her wedding. It sucks, man. It sucks. But anyway, it's gonna take a little bit, so I'm gonna go ahead and just quickly fast forward it, okay? Alright. Now we can lure him to a secluded spot away from peeping eyes and then we will shoot a bullet of magnificence into his skull right into his eye socket now I don't I'm looking at those bushes up there by the staircase and like this bush I'm not so sure if he can go inside of those bushes so I'm, I don't want to risk it I'm thinking about taking him to that little fountain where I shot that other guard earlier Unless... There's, a, there's another little fountain area right there. You know what? We're going to have him go to that spot and then we'll shoot him. There we go! And we hit the body. Fantastic. We have successfully hidden all bodies from peeping eyes except for that one dude by the uh by the uh altar or the area where everyone was all sitting at and the priest was there to marry the the couple but there we go silent assassin ranking i think personal best and we just got two little perks for our sniper rifle so this ladies and gentlemen is hitman sniper assassin i really enjoyed this and i hope you all did too like and subscribe Comment your thoughts below, and we will get back to our assassin another time. Peace out, have a good day. No, no, I insist. You use the master bedroom for your honeymoon. That's where you were conceived, honey. Well done. <laughs> I have way too much fun with this fucking game, I swear. Good God.